Hey guys, what's up, what's happening? You got the King of Games 98 here at your service. How you doing? Hope y'all are doing good and staying safe. So, this is crazy, okay? This is crazy. Today, the day I'm recording this is Thursday, August 8th, 2024. Now, for most people, that date means absolutely nothing. And up until yesterday, I didn't know that this date had any significance to me personally until I checked on my YouTube channel. And what is significant about today, you may ask, that involves me? Well, seven years ago today, on this very day, I started this YouTube channel. I started doing YouTube and, you know, at that time I wasn't known as the King of Games 98. It was literally just my first and last name. Now for the purposes of my privacy, I am not going to say my last name, but it said Brendan and my last name because when I made my YouTube account, it synced with my Google account and my Gmail because Gmail is owned by Google. And so it just came up with my first and last name. So when I started my YouTube channel, it was literally just Brendan and my last name. That was it. And I started this YouTube channel being called just my first and last name on August 8th of 2016. So where was I at in my life in 2016, you may ask? Well, 2016 is the year I graduated high school. So it would have been the summer I graduated high school. And I specifically remember talking to a lot of people and friends that were also in the video games like myself, and they would just be blown away with my knowledge and, you know, information of video games, video game consoles, video game companies, you know, peripherals, accessories. They were just blown away by my knowledge and said, you should really do a YouTube channel. You should really do a YouTube channel. Have you ever thought about doing a YouTube channel? And at first, the thought, the, the thought had crossed my mind. Trust me, guys. It, it had crossed my mind. But, you know, at that time, 2016, you know, I was looking at other professional, professional YouTubers. And they would have these crazy cameras, these crazy expensive microphones, a high-end computer, editing software, editors people to write their scripts, and I just kind of went, I'm 18 years old. I just graduated high school. How can I afford that? I can't afford that. Are you kidding me? And I, I just kind of brushed it off at first, like it was nothing. But on a whim, I took a chance. I took a chance, and... I recorded a video, and it is neither gaming related or anime related. I recorded a cheesy, I'll be the first to admit, a super cheesy video of myself riding a mini bike throughout an open field um, at a motorcycle swap meet I was at with my dad. That was the whole video. Super cheesy. I don't think the picture quality is that great. It might be 720p HD, if that. Because, you know, 2016, what phone did I have at that time? I guess that would have been my Motorola. I guess it would have been my Motorola. Maybe my Motorola Moto G7 Power? Maybe? 
I don't know. I don't know, guys, because like I, I've been I've been through a lot of cell phones in my life, and I can remember the names of the majority of them, but specifically in 2016, I don't remember exactly what phone cell phone I was rocking at that time. Now, keep in mind, you know, at that time, I just had you know the whimsical idea to record this video using my cell phone, and so you know it came out how it came out more or less, and I just said, you know what, I'm going to send it. I'm going to, I'm going to post it to YouTube. I'm just going to see what happens. And I could not believe, I could not believe it was getting views. It was getting comments. It was getting likes. I'm like, wait, what? This is just a cheesy video of me recording myself on my cell phone, riding this mini bike throughout this open field at this swap meet. And it's actually getting views, it's getting likes, it's getting comments? Wow! Like, I was dumbfounded by that. And in case you want to watch it, I will link that video at the end of this video because I feel like that's only proper. Because that was my first ever YouTube video and this is commemorating my seven year anniversary since I started my YouTube channel. So I feel like that's only the right thing to do. So I couldn't believe that. I couldn't believe that. Like the, the majority of the comments I was getting were from friends, um, from high school and, you know, other people. And, you know, it was great. It was, it was, it was great. Like I actually couldn't believe people enjoyed that as much as they did. And from there, I just was like, you know what? I'm going to take the chance. Because what have I got to lose? You know, in the grand scheme of things, what do you have to lose when starting a YouTube channel? Because like, seriously, what are you going to lose? You know, um, maybe just time, you know, because if, if you're really serious and dedicated to, you know, doing YouTube videos and YouTube in general, and, you know, you have to take the time out of your day to record a video, to edit a video, write a script, possibly hire editors, you know, all that stuff. In the grand scheme of things, what are you, what are you losing? Just time? I mean, I guess, you know, depending on if you hire people, yeah, you're going to be losing money too. But in the grand scheme of things, you know, you don't need to hire people. You don't need high-end um, cameras and GoPros and Yeti microphones and, or is it Yeti or is it Blue Snowball? Whatever it's called. Uh, you don't need a high-end computer with editing software, you know, uh, Adobe Audition or, um, Adobe, uh, or, um, is it, is it, is it Adobe or is it Apple Final Cut Pro? Whatever. You don't need them. You can still make perfectly good YouTube videos without all of that. And all you really need is yourself and a cell phone. And, you know, I'm not telling you that that's how you need to do it. But if you really, really wanted to do it like how I started out, there's nothing wrong with that. There is, there is absolutely nothing wrong with that. In 2024. So, whew, that was basically talking about my history on YouTube and my very first ever video that I uploaded onto the channel. And now I guess I just want to say thank you. Thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart. It means the world to me that I have had so much support over these seven years and the retro gaming community on YouTube is fantastic. It is absolutely fantastic. I could not ask for a better community to be included in on a social media platform than on YouTube. It is just freaking amazing. I love it, you know. I, I think back to the days that when I was on Instagram, which that was roughly 2016, so seven years ago. When I was on Instagram, I felt welcomed. 
in the retro gaming community and scene for that matter on that platform. Instagram opened me with big arms and invited me in. I met so many fantastic people on Instagram and discovered games I never heard of, platforms I never heard of, and hidden gem games I never heard of that you, you know, you really need to play this. And, you know, it's a shame that my run on Instagram ended as it did because ultimately I got kicked off and when I went to email them, I never got a reply back. So that was the day I made a Twitter, but that's the story for a whole nother day. But, you know, I really, really like the retro gaming community and scene on YouTube, probably as much as I liked it on Instagram, but I might like this slightly more only because, you know, this is, you know, video format. This is YouTube short format. This is YouTube post format. You know, on Instagram, at least back in 2016, you know, back seven years ago on Instagram, to what I can remember, it was just posting uh, multiple pictures, videos, or uh, Instagram story video, and that was really it. Um, you know, that was seven years ago, so I don't know if they changed it now. I don't know. Um, if they did, great. Um, if they didn't, oh well. I don't really care either way because I'm not making another account on there because I don't feel like making another email and you know what? They just couldn't take the time to email me back. So I don't need to be on there. So thank you so much guys for supporting me on YouTube for seven years. That's just freaking amazing. I'm blown away by that and I just love it. I, I, I really love it. Like, I love that I'm able to go to a social media and express my love of video games and anime and be able to ramble and talk about it and you guys like it and enjoy it. That means a lot to me because, you know, prior, prior to me doing YouTube, I mean, yeah, I, I did talk to different people on Instagram about it, but like other than that and then talking to my friends about games, I didn't really have anyone else to like go to. I didn't have a social media site where I could go and talk about and ramble about video games of our past and of the past. And, you know, say, you know, oh, this is a really banger game. This is a hidden gem. You need to play this right now. It is totally worth your time. You know, I didn't have that. I did not have that. And I think it's wonderful okay, that YouTube exists as a platform. And even if it is owned by Google, don't care. I still think it's amazing that it exists as a platform, as a social media platform, as an outlet for us to talk to people across the world and voice our opinions and talk about our hobbies, our topics, what we like, what we dislike, and people be able to watch them and comment on them and you know, we, we connect, we meet people and connect by that and meet like-minded people or people that don't, you know, disagree with us. I love that aspect. I really do. And so, yeah, you know, at, at, at first, before I recorded this video, I, I, I wasn't really sure how to, how I wanted to make this video. You know, I, 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 I at first was like, should I make it, you know, something gaming related or, you know, should I do something anime related for a special, you know, like I did for the 300 subscriber special video. But then I was like, no, no, you know what? I'm just going to talk. I'm just going to talk to you guys, me to you, mano y mano, like I'm talking to you right now in the same room as me in my house. I'm, I'm just going to talk to you guys just like that. And you know what? I think it was perfect just doing it like this. And I don't think I really do enough videos like this. So if you like this style of video of me just talking to you just like this, let me know in the comments section. And again, thank you guys so much for supporting me for seven years on YouTube. This is crazy to think about, but I love it. I don't regret it. 
I have absolutely zero regrets when it comes to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And in case you want to watch my very first ever YouTube video, I will link it here now at the end of this video. And yeah, let me know if you guys like this type of video of me just talking to you guys like this. Thank you so much for watching and take care. Thank you for seven years and here's to seven more years.